guys, Aridania here. So it's been a little bit since I've done a vlog and I have decided that this isn't going to be a regular vlog because I was just sitting here drawing and I got an idea. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go with it. I'm gonna see how it works. If you guys like it, then I will do more. But this is kind of just like a test run. So I've been thinking, like I like I said, I was just sitting here drawing and I've always wanted to try doing a speed drawing, but that's not what this is. I just got a text. That's not what this is. I cannot do a speed drawing because the best camera I have is my iPod, and I can't... I don't have, like... It, just, it won't work. Like, how it has to be perfectly centered over the drawing, and, like, I can't get in the way, and I just... I can't do it yet with this camera. I can't. I need like an actual like professional camera with a tripod and that's just my mindset that that's what I need in order to be able to do a speed run. So this isn't going to be a speed run but I thought that I could talk you guys through my drawing process. Now I want to do it for at least one drawing. Like I'm not gonna do it like start to finish because drawings do take a long time but well I don't know, like I said, this is a test run, so I'm going to try out what I want to do on here, and then if you guys like it, I'll do more. Uh, so first off, uh, I'm going to give you guys a little bit of a sketchbook tour, because I got a new sketchbook, and I've been drawing some, and I haven't shown you guys, so I thought that would be a cool place to start, so let's do this. This is the first drawing that I have, well, that I can actually show you guys. My other drawings are uh, stuff for uh, writing, and I can't really show you because it's kind of secret. But anyway, so this is the first drawing I can show you, and this is the Season 3B Teen Wolf poster. Uh, so we got Tyler Posey, Dylan O'Brien, and Crystal Reed. Uh, so that's my first one. This was all done in pencil over the course of about... Mm, 8 to 12 hours. This is the second drawing I have, and this one was inspired uh, by the Teen Wolf when Styles was possessed by the Nagitsune. So I actually have named this one Shattered, as you can see, and I just really like the whole concept of this one because I didn't, like, as you can see, his face is a little bit distorted in the shattered glass, and that was the new thing for me that I really wanted to try out, and I am actually really happy with the result so yeah that's this one i actually posted this one on twitter if you want to see it steady without my shaking hand <laughs> here is one of my favorite sketches that i have in my sketchbook it is of holland roden in one of her photo shoots and i absolutely adore holland roden and this was actually my the first sketch i've ever done that was full pencil crayon and so it was very, very different, and it took a long time, but I'm so happy with the turnout, and I actually haven't posted this anywhere else. Like, no one else has seen this except for my friends. So, enjoy the first look. Woo! This one is also a full-color sketch. This one of Hugh Jackman and Jennifer Lawrence as Wolverine and Mystique from X-Men Days of Future Past. And I absolutely adore that movie. It was so good. So I just really wanted to try doing it. And I knew I had to do this in full cover because, let's face it, Mystique is blue. And I've never gotten to draw someone blue before. So this is really interesting to try. Finally, we have Captain Killian Jones, also known as Hook from Once Upon a Time, played by Colin O'Donoghue. And... This is actually the first full pencil sketch that I've done in a long time, and I've actually really, really missed doing it. So this was a lot of fun. I actually just finished this one yesterday, so I haven't posted it anywhere, but it will be posted everywhere soon. I hope you guys like it. My little sketchbook tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. So right now, before I actually start the drawing that I'm going to do, once, once again, this is just um, a trial thing, so I wouldn't do this every time that I did a drawing, but since this is my first one, I just want to give you guys like a little more insight on my actual process. So I'm gonna say like this is what I do 
before I actually start drawing. First I put on my YouTube playlist that has like 47 of my favorite songs for all you Studia shippers out there. This is a must have on your Studia playlist, but I usually listen to this whenever I am drawing or writing. This is getting all my supplies, so I have all of my artist pencils, I have my blending stomps, I have a lot more blending stomps, but these are the only ones I use, or, or the ones that I use the most. I got the 5 16th one, the 1 4th, this one I think is 1 8th, it's really tiny and bent, can you see I use it a lot? And then I use the 3 8 I also have a kneadable eraser, or at least a piece of one. And then an old, one of those old iPod erasers. And back here you have my little Kleenex, which is basically so you're drawing, so you don't smudge. That's what that is for. References for all of my drawings, uh, just off the internet, and then I have them on my iPod, and so you can like zoom in and everything. And I think it's... Mm, sometimes I do print out my references, but it is rare that I do that. I usually just go off my iPod. Um, so right now, my reference is going to be Teen Wolf. Surprise, surprise. I've been obsessed with it because, let's face it, the new season's out. It was just Comic-Con. I'm Teen Wolf crazy right now. So I'm going to be doing Dylan Sprayberry as Liam, Liam Dunbar. From Teen Wolf, he's a new character on Teen Wolf, and I adore him so much. So we got to see one of like his actual first full werewolf transformation. So, and I realized I haven't actually drawn a werewolf yet. So that's about to change. So you, I'm just gonna start with a blank sketchbook page, and I'm going to do a step-by-step -step process. So I hope you guys like it. Okay, so the sketch has been started. So I start off all my sketches with just a very rough outline uh, done in my 4H pencil. So here, a little bit, just of a little outline that I have. And this is how I start all my sketches. And for this sketch, I actually want to try something a little bit different. Because usually what I do is I do my little outline. And I do this outline just to make sure that everything fits on the page and like where I want it to be so that I'm not like halfway through the sketch and I'm like, oh no, I don't have enough room for this. So that's the reason why I do that. But usually what I do is after I have this outline down, I usually just take my 4H pencil and I do the entire sketch just in 4H in all like all the detail everything just very very light and then I go over it with a bunch of other pencils but I want to try something a little bit different with this one mostly because this is supposed to be a very very dark contrast so and it's really hard to pull off a dark contrast when you start off using really light pencils so what I want to what I'm gonna try is say I'm just gonna go right to his eye Say I'll start here, and what I want to do is I want to do full detail. I want to do, start off full detail and do just little parts all in full detail. So like I'll start here and just branch off with full detail, not because usually I do like a layering effect, and I'm still gonna do a layer layering effect, just section by section, not all at once. And I actually think that that's gonna have a different outlook, and I really want to try it. So. That is what I'm going to do. So I'm going to get started on that right now. Um, and then uh, I'll film again when I have his eye done so you can see what happened. I'll talk a little bit about that. Okay, so I've been drawing for a while and I've been using my new technique. We're just starting them in place and I'm really liking it right now. So right now I have his eye still very rough still a lot of work to do so right after on top of my um no little layout lines rough sketch ish i used my i started off with my 3h so that's basically what you see is all all of this 
like all here is done with my 3H and then I moved to my B and that is like that dark part that you see right here and starting up there. So I'm darkening it up now and I'm really enjoying what's happening. So I'm going to darken it up a little bit more and then I'm probably going to I'm either going to move into the forehead or the nose. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Um, and I'm not quite sure where I'm going to end this video because I'm, it's going to be way too long if I do the entire sketch. Like all right now because I've done the sketchbook tour and I've done like all the preparations. So I think that, you know what, I think I'm going to end this video here. The eye. Uh, I think that's what's going to happen. So I'm going to end this video here. Um, but I am not going to end my Liam werewolf drawing. Let me explain. Okay. So I can't just leave you guys hanging on the eye. Because that's just, that's just not nice of me. So I'm going to make a part two of this video just to finish up my Liam sketch. Uh, I don't know when it's going to come, but I'm going to continue working on it after I'm done editing and the uploading and all that fun stuff that comes with making a video. Um, so that's going to be a part two. And I want you guys to comment what you thought of this video. Because... Um, yes, I'm going to finish the Liam one, but I don't know if I'm going to do any ones after that. I will if you guys want me to, so it's all up to you. Uh, or if I really just love how it turned out, then I'll be like, yeah, I'll do it again. Uh, I'm, I'm liking it so far, so I think I'm going to do it again, but I just want to make sure that you guys don't, like, hate it or something before I do it. And so you guys know not every video is going to be like this one. Um, the... If I continue after this, it's just going to be the drawing part. It's not going to be like the big long introduction like, oh here I use these kind of pencils. I listen to this kind of music. It's not going to be that. I just did this one because it was my first one. So, but that's kind of how it's going to be. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, I don't know. I don't know because this was kind of started out as a vlog, so I don't know if I should end this like a vlog or if I should end this like an original video. So, you know what? Let's end it like an original. Let's say thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. I put out new videos every Tuesday and I vlog every other day. This may be a new art segment that could come out whenever. I don't know yet. But anyway, I am Ira Dania and thank you for watching.